Hello. Hello. Habari? Nzuri. Mimi naitwa Emmanuel Mushumbe mwanzangu anaitwa Sugar Boy. Ah, Mushumbe. How are you, madam? I'm fine. No, unaitwa nani, my sister? Naitwa Na naona umetumia yeah. SMS kwamba ungelipenda tuingie katika kesi mashinani. Eh. Kutoka upande gani wa Kenya, Veronica? Om country ni Yaya. Si Yaya? Lakini sahi ni kwa Nairobi. Kazi yako ni gani if you don't mind? Yeah, nafanya nafanya kazi kwa Mpesa. O kwa Mpesa? Eh. Kazi yako ama umeajiriwa? Nimeajiriwa. No problem. So, kesi yako ni gani my dear? Naishi na mamangu. Ndio. Ba- babangu mzazi mimi mwenyewe simjui. Ndio. So mama alinipeleka ngaosha go nikaishi na shosho. Ehe. Uh-huh. So nikasoma huko kifikia form 1 hapo. Ndio. Shosha kaanza kwa mgonjwa kiasi so form 1 nilisoma, form 2 nilisoma partially. Ndio. Form 3 nilienda tu kufanya hiyo exam ya kuenda form 4. Okay. Alafu form 4 sasa niseme nilianza kusoma vizuri hapo term 2. Term 2 form 4. Eh uh, so I ended up scoring a D plus so which sikujua kama nitapata. Okay so at least uh, ata ile ku surprise wewe kupata D+ manake yani kusema tu kweli 80% you have not been in school. Uh, so how old are you right yeah, now? I'm 20. 20 years. Mm. Uh-huh. So so kukuja Nairobi. Mm. Nilikuja Nairobi 2020 February. Uh-huh. So alafu corona ikapita hiyo March. Ndio. Mamangu akasimamishwa kazi. Oh my god. Eh. Uh-huh aka aka kwa nyumba hadi february ndio akarudi job ndio so hiyo february alirudi akarudi job mm akaumia match alivunjika ngumu ile ilikuwa na fracture ya mfupa na dislocation hapo kwa anko pole sana so as i speak to you mm bado yuko kwa nyumba ndio mguu haijarudi sawa anafaa apeleke apeleke mama Lucy hizo hospital kubwa kubwa okay aweke chuma kwa mguu Ndiyo? Ndo hizo mifupa zirudi ya nesawa nda hizo kusembea Poli sana Oso hii kazi ya mpesa ilibili ni kajikafikia yu last year mm. July mm-hmm. So nilikuwa maifa nye tu sasa bosu wangu mm. Alikuwa na nipima sijiwa kuna interest na mimi ni limuambia nga achane na mimi mm. Sina interest na ye kwa sabu ye ako married na ako na responsibilities ako na watoto Uhum so immediately alijua mamangu ameumia kwa nyumba sasa yeah. anajua sisi kp job uh-huh. he took advantage of me uh-huh. anytime ana feel like having sex with me ana ifanya tu hivyo okay so as i took you now eh yeah. bibi yake sijui mtu alimwambia simu akanipigia simu akanikeleleza yeah. of which this mwezi wa june eh uh-huh. nilipoteza eh nilipoteza pesa yake okay Na hizo sema ni kutokana na ile ile kelele mgepigwa na bibi yake uh-huh. Na ile situation niku uh-huh. Na ile situation mamangu hako So tulikuwa tunasaidiwa na brother ya mamu Ok Baso sae ya ligoma So mama kutu kwa nyumba uh-huh. Anafa kuti kupelekwa hosia tibiwe hiyo mguye ujisawa Hiyo doa kuna uh-huh. Uja mana nitumia Ana nitumia kingono mbaka nimechoka na sikia kwa chai joba Sasa siyuzi hacha kulingana na ile situation Tuka hakuna mta na provide ile pesa na pewa uh-huh. Tuna provide na yo kwa nyumba Ndiyo Hiyo pia aliniambia hiyo talari nito atakata uh-huh. Kulipia hiyo do Ulianza kukuliambia kwamba Huyu jamaa alikutongoza bosu wako kwa fupi Sidiyo Kwa hali nitongoza ni kakataba Sasa alikuja Ukakataa kabisa Nilimkata update Alafu? But sasa hey, anytime I may, I may feel like having sex. So ni wakati gani wamba ulikubali tena, ulianza kukumkubali tena? Siku mkubali, ni ile tuwa nakuja na nguvu zake. Anakuja na? Nguvu zake. Nguvu kivipi? What do you mean nguvu? Ni ile tu anakuja, ni ile uh-huh. nataka kufunga, uh-huh. anakaa pandani. Uh-huh. Then nikisha funga, ananza tuku, kunifika fika ni kimuambia chane na mimi. Ok. Ni ile tu, ni ile anatumia tu nguvu zake. Mm. It's just having sex with me by force But sasa si na option to sign kikuiti job Ok Siji venye itakuwa juu Sign me ndo na provide kwa nyumba Mami yako kwa nyumba Si na Dio. kada Sasa si na kanga So uwa anakuja na kushika kwa nguvu mm. Kwa zayo ni ubakaji Uwa anakubaka kwa hivyo Kwa ufupe uwa anakubaka Ndiyo Mbanaki kufanya kitendo changono Kwa nguvu na mtu ambacha taki Uwa ni ubakaji Ndiyo So uwa anakubaka popo karika kazi ofisini Hmm Kama marangapi vya mekubaka? 
More than five times. More than five times. Mm. So kwa sababu ya situation yako ambayo unaipa una, una, una situation yako kwa hivi sasa ambao unakabiliana nayo katika maishani you always give in. Sasa kuna venye nitafanya juu niki quit. Mm. Sasa venye kuna corona kuna mtu ako ready kupeana hiyo job. Okay. Sasa inanibidi tu ni accept the situation. Nipate venye venye nitamsaidia mamangu. Kwa hivyo huwa anakuja tu anafanya kitendo chake hata maybe maybe hata bila kinga nini mm. oh my god no so akifanya hicho huwa uh, akifanya kitendo hicho cha kukubaka huwa anasema nini yeye ukwambia nini yeye yeah, ananiambia si hivyo hivyo ndo wa maybe anatumia anga kwa extra experience zake kwangu kwa sababu mimi simelewi ati au anasema mm nilimkataa kwa sababu sielewi feeling zile zile feeling za ako nazo kwangu okay so so hiyo ndo njia anatumia ku express na vitisho vya vyote labda ama huwa anafanya tu alafu anaenda zake. Nile tu anafanya tu ameenda zake. Anafanya anaenda zake. Mm. Sielewi. Ka okay, najua uko katika situation, I know that, eh? Najua mm. mama yako ni mgonjwa, pole kwa hilo. Mm. Na najua pia wewe unapitia situations hapa na pale, pole kwa hilo, mm. ni maisha. Lakini sielewi kwa nini umekubali wakati wote mtu anakudhulumu kingono kwa sababu in that situation kwa au long utakuwa ukibakwa mara kia nakubaka sina option kwa sababu hata kama una Sina... option surely unakubali vipi kubakwa kila wakati jamani my sister unaona as i talk to you eh <laughs> kutokea hiyo mark mm atujai lipa nyumba mm so venye 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 nilipata hii job eh <laughs> mama alikuwa analipa partially na nalipa partially basi sasa venye alisimamishwa job mm rent iko hivyo constant mm tunalipia tu za hivi days to come mm. lakini hizo area bado hazijalipwa ziko tu okay mm. so that's why you niko na shusha wangu sha go mm. maybe yeye yeah, pia kuna venye ananitegemea juu yeye pia ni yale nitunza na hizo sema hivyo ndio nimesema kwamba napata matatizo yako na kuelewa vizuri jamani na ile kwamba wewe ndio mm. kila kitu lakini mm. cuz ni kitu ambacho ukitaki huko mm. kubakwa For how long? For how long? For how long? Ute, paka lini? Paka lini? Unajua Alisha niambia eh. if I expose it. Eh. Atanifanyia kitu mbaya. Ukiexpose atakutumia kitu kibaya, atakufanyia kitu kibaya. Na furthermore I'm a single child, sina brother sina. Mm. Mm. So wewe kwa sababu kwa sababu utakwe, kwa sababu atakufanyia kitu kibaya, kwa sababu ya shida zako ambazo uko nazo, so umeamua uteseke tu mpaka lini? inaibidi tu nivumilie kwa sababu ile unajua ile situation niko kuna zingine hata sizi kuambia So unataka nikusaidie namna gani? Mimi naomba tu saidizi wenye. Mm. Maybe kama mnisaidia nipate yodo ya kumpeleka usi alafu maybe nilipie hiyo pesa haki nipotea. Mm. Alafu ni quick job inaweza kuwa tu sawa. Mimi nasambia wa Kenya maybe wakusaidie. <laughs> Lakini mimi nataka kwanza tu na hichi kitendo ambao kumekuwa kifanywa cha unyama cha kubakwa. Mm. Na umekuwa ukinyamazia. Na mtu ambaye anakutendea hicho kinyama cha kitendo cha unyama unajua. Ni boss wangu. It is not fair. Kwa nini akufanyia hivyo? Why is he taking yeah. advantage of your situation? Sasa sijui. Unajua alichukua bibi yake akapeleka ushago. Ndio? Kwa mimi mimi mwenyewe simelewi totally. Si tunataka uripoti chikisa police police station. Ku reporti already hiyo kesi ya pesa ilipotea iku station na ifuatilia uvik iko sure kama hiyo ndio itapatikana because sijui kwa nini uteseke kwa nini uteseke at kwa sababu of your situation i don't know why uteseke because of somebody is taking advantage of you kwa nini upate mimi, shida mbona uteseke mbona udhulumiwe kingono kwa sababu umepoteza pesa mtu kwa sababu uko na matatizo no you don't deserve this veronica you don't deserve you don't i know i don't deserve. you don't deserve this mtu amekubaka mara ya kwanza umenyamaza ya pili ya tatu, ya nne, ya tano. Umeniambia mara ngapi amekufanyia hichi kitendo? More than five times. More than five times. Mimi tukiningependa eh nikipata hiyo hiyo usaidizi. Mm. Nikipit job niachane tu na yeye hivyo. Asije what I'm planning niachane tu na job. Niona yeye ni msaidia mamangu aende usini ili akikuwa akikuwa sawa rudi job ile itakuwa tu sawa. Wewe fanye hivi? Mm. Kesi mashinani. Mm. Court number 9. Mm. Sisi kwanza tunataka uripoti chikisa cha kudhulumiwa kingono. Mm. Ushaona? Mm. We want we want to expose this guy. And I promise you eh? Mm. 
Kenyans will help you. Wa Kenya utakusaidia. Wamesaidia mara nyingi sana. Kenyans will help you. People people should not take advantage at because now you have problem mm -hmm. mtu sasa anakutumia kama chombo chake mm -hmm. anakuja anakubaka hapo kwa kazi yake kila saa kwa sababu kuna dela 140000 we can tell Kenyans wa kusaidia na 140000 na mama pelekwa hospitali mama Lucy najua we want you to expose this guy lakini hiyo kesi ya pesa iko huko lakini sasa eh ile request yangu ni moja gani sitaki mpigie simu Atumpigii simu yoze kwa atu, uko na evidence yeah. kwamba amekuwa akikufanyia hicho kitendo. Bila na kid evidence ni msimu. Je, hata nikisema tu hivi maybe amezaruka, eh. kama mtu anizania mimi. Eh. Eh. Kurepo mtu, kurepo mtu ni kitu akitakani katika a inchi. Crime. It is a crime exactly. Wala... Lakini hii yeah. story ati wewe unaficha uovu, unaficha crime, unaficha kitendo cha unyama unashinda ukibakwa kila saa na boss wako hapo kazini tena kila siku anakuja na kushika kwa nguvu anakubaka hivyo anafanyage hichi kitendo wapi kwa floor juu ju, ya meza kwa kiti uaga inatokea wapi mimi nilikuja job nikapata matress nyingine hapa na kujenga hiyo ndo anatumia kuna paka matress hapo kazini Mm. Kwa hivyo I, I want to em, em, tell me tell me give me give me the picture ni, ni chorei picture huwa kikupata ukifunga mlango what happens ni chorei picture nipatie picture nione iki kitendo vile wakinatokea ni chorei picture ni ile tu anakuja na kunishika shika eh uh -huh. then anani drug uh -huh. then ananiangusha kwa hiyo mattress ndio so ile kufai ile kumfaitisha eh uh -huh. anaenda ngatwa next time baka na ni slap baka na ni chuna ndio yes finally ana kwanga mehavio yuko tunataka so does it mean wapi maybe ukipigwa makofi ukiwa nini wewe una give ni ama ni vipi unajua makofi ya mwanaume hawezi linganisha na na makofi ya mwanamke kweli so ai jamani ah no 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 na huwa ni mida ya sanga pingapi kwa sababu umali kama hapa ambao kuna kama kibanda ya pesa lazima kuna watu baadhi pale eh huwa nafunga 8:30 yes Wa so, so anakuja hiyo 8:30. Hapana anaweza kuja hata 5 na anakaa tu hapa mpaka hiyo time. Paka 8:30. Mm. So you don't shout, you have never shouted. Mm, mm. You have never called for help. Kuna siku nyingine nilishout. Eh. But sasa jirani yako kuja ili kitu alifanya. Eh. Alienda akapigia best yake simu, eh. akapigia best yake story. Eh. Sasa wewe best yake ndo alipigia bibi ya huyu jamaa simu sio bibi ya huyu jamaa alipigia simu kunitetesha I promise we will sort you out. We will help you. But we want you to expose so, this guy. Yes. Mama kwa unahitaji pesa ngapi kutibiwa mama Lucy? Ile kuwekewa hiyo chuma kwa kwa mguu si hizi joe na kosi pesa ngapi juu? Usijai kama cross kick kanyo. Kile kitu kiko, we want you to expose this guy. Yes, I'll Because even if it even if visa vinafanyika katika jamii na vinyamanyama ziwa. Mm. Watu kama wanafaa kuwe ndani. Yes, ndio mimi expose nikisha nikisha mpesa yake alafu nikakuti job. Yes, that's the only thing I need to do just say. Sasa hivi nikifanya hivyo kioni. Sasa fanya hivi. Mm. Amesha kuja. Mm. Sasa start ya jua kile kinaendelea. We'll call you later we, to be continued. We'll call you tomorrow. Sasa. 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 All right.